Hey there, cats and kitties. I am the Blues Man, SXE Blues, and this is going to be a brief little review for the 2011 Doctor Who Christmas special, The Doctor, The Widow, and The Wardrobe. Uh, this was a pretty good episode overall, and, you know, in the line of Doctor Who Christmas specials we've seen over the past few years, you know, the last one was really good, this one was really good, they've all always been really good, but I think these last two have been some of the best, uh, you know, that's probably down to Stephen Moffat and the people behind the episode, but um, as far as things that stood out to me, I don't want to give any spoilers here, but uh, I loved, you know, as usual, Matt Smith's performance. There was uh, some humor, you know, peppered throughout it, but it was a little more subdued than we've seen in other episodes, which was a plus. Um, I really loved his inquisitive nature coming to the fore, not really knowing what was going on on this planet, you know, with the trees and everything. And um, the guest cast, the mother and children, they were also spot on as well. I really enjoyed, you know, their performances, as well as the uh, three astronauts from Androzani. I loved that, by the way, the reference to Caves of Androzani, you know, going back to the fifth Dr. Peter Davison's final episodes and uh, little nods like that. We also got a reference to the Forest of Cheem, which, you know, ninth Dr. and Rose era. And um, so, yeah, I, I loved it. There was something for everybody in this episode. And of course, an affirming uh, ending, which was definitely a plus. I like that it wasn't, you know, the Doctor necessarily saved the day it was kind of left to the mother a little bit more and um you know rather than having the doctor just hand everyone a brilliant christmas kind of thing and uh so yeah it was a definitely a thumbs up episode and um that's going to be all i have to say on it so uh if you haven't seen it i suggest you check it out and otherwise i hope this video finds you well so that'll be it for me and i'll catch you all later peace